Hi guys, this is Kaisa Sumai. Welcome back to the channel. So tomorrow, I'm gonna go to the Arkham Lounge and do a little painting with other painters and other people from the hobby. And yeah, I'll show you guys what I'm gonna pack for tomorrow. So this is my pencil case, uh, which I store some stuff when I sketch. The reason why I'm bringing this is because I'm gonna bring a sketchbook, one of my old sketchbook, and I'm gonna do a swatching of all the Arkham paints. Besides, I could have all access of the all of their paints, so might as well make a swatch book about it. So I would have a guide when I'm painting. These are parchment paper for my DIY wet palette. This is like a mask holder that I made a palette because the last sweat palette I had was like my professional one was a little bulky <laughs> took so much space I'm just gonna bring a smaller one and then gloves because the last time I was there uh, they didn't have gloves and it was paint all over my hand so gloves painting stick and my sticky tech I'm gonna bring that too this is my brush case brush holder um, I'm gonna bring some red sables here. I haven't tried them yet. A dry brush, a brush for pigments, and this Citadel brush that I hate so much, and these two red sables that I just got. <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna be using them because those are my main brushes. So these are the figures that I'm gonna be painting. This is Raven. You can have so far they're like being chilled here because I just merely washed them in prime. So yeah, this is gonna be the ones I'm gonna be painting for tomorrow. Now packing everything in my bag and ready to go. After like a 20 minute trip, and I'm finally in the Arkham Lounge, which is a beautiful place. Been there for twice now, so look at me spinning around. The moment you enter the establishment, you'll be puzzled by a stack of so many Arkham paints. Like, oh my gosh, a lot, a lot. With so many varieties for lacquer, water-based, oils, and so much more. There's also spaces for artists to display their scale models, their figures, and even paintings if you wanted to. And look how the amazing they are. Like Local artists make amazing works and you can just see them next to the painting lounge that they have for you to be inspired for your next work. What's great about this place is they have a dedicated airbrush room where you can airbrush your mini minis or prime them, whatever, completely with stuff you needed. A very quiet compressor, good lights, and a very well ventilated room with an excess fun in front of you, and it's amazing. And of course, I take advantage of that room and prime my raven figures, because why not? Might as well. After airbrushing, I prepared my spot in the hand painting lounge where I'm gonna prepare to hand paint my prime ravens and look at the view as I get inspiration and continue painting. I love this place, good lighting. They're also gonna install dedicated lights for each table, which I'm so excited for. Uh, good air condition so you won't have problems being sweaty while painting. It's very, very, very cool. Staff is 10 out of 10 amazing, very hospitable staff. I love them. I really do. Even their in-house painters are very helpful. They will guide you through all of the paints, all of the products that they have, and they might help you in so many, many ways. They even bought us drinks and offered us nuts, which is also nuts. <laughs> You know what's the best part of the Arkham Lounge? You get to paint with amazing painters from the hobby. Hey, we are in the Arkham Lounge with the boys and Bianca. Say hi! <laughs> I completed my 168 paint swatch book and I'm so happy. So guys, I really highly recommend you should go to the Arkham Lounge. A very, very fun place to paint and enjoy with other fellow hobbyists. So yeah, this is Kaizen sending you to the Arkham Lounge. And I will see you guys in the next video or in the Arkham Lounge.